As many of you know, Nadia and Lena were supposed to fight, but it looks like Kayla took to her TikTok to throw a few subliminal messages towards Nadia after she didn't link up to fight Lena, as well as because Nadia once again put Kayla's name in the title of her YouTube video. So here's what some people had to say about Kayla's subliminals aimed at Nadia. I was waiting on Wednesday for no reason. Someone also said, why get on a show if you are going to complain about your name being mentioned? Then Kayla went on a live stream and confirmed that she linked up with Lena for next week. Some think she will be going there to fight Nadia. Yeah, Lena, like, she took her hair down and then fell asleep. But I'm gonna be back down here next week too. I got a 20B. And then in the morning before we go, we gonna go to the mall, but... I don't even know if I'm gonna find anything that I need at the mall for real. Let me know what you think about it down in the comment section below. Nadia's bestie Ida also hit up her Insta to spill the tea on the drama between Lena and Nadia. Here's what she had to say. Y'all was looking on my ass trying to compare me to a different person and it, it never gave that. And this is no shade, this is all facts. I don't run in between the both of them and spread their business, nor do I allow each other to talk about each other in a disrespectful manner. You feel me? When I'm with them, it's cool. I've known Lena before I knew Nadia. I knew them before they had the beef. You feel me? So our friendships are separate. Even if they got cool, their beef came out of nowhere. So to me, it's childish. If they're going to fight, they're going to fight. That has nothing to do with me. But as a real friend, I stay out of it. And Fendi's music video had nothing to do with anything he been made that song and was like oh why is you in the video if my brother asked me to support his video and i know when he wrote the song and i heard the song when it was first made i'm gonna be there now talking about nadia it seems like messy madge went live where he addressed rumors that he had revealed some private information about nadia claiming that he never exposed nadia's chart okay okay so when it came to the whole prescription thing my team sent me the, 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 the message with the person and I read it on live. Never did I show any form of any of her documentation when it came to any my chart or anything that involves her prescription. I never, I never announced what prescriptions was named on her shit or anything. I never said anything. I never gave any detail. Now, based on Messy Maj, it seems like he didn't expose her chart, but someone else did and got into her information. But let me know who you think could have done that down in the comments below. Now, I do want to speak on this next topic with Net, because it looks like she has finally stepped out with her new boyfriend. Many supporters thought that her and BJ might get back together, since BJ mentioned in some live streams that he misses her. He said there were just a few things that needed fixing for their relationship to work but net isn't having it and she doesn't want to rekindle things with bj 